Jingle bells ringing in my ear. Jingle bell, a sound that's oh so dear. Frosty the snowman is all around town. Watch out for rain, these are falling. Hi everyone, welcome to day 22 of Vlogmas. My name is Yanni, if you're new. I cannot believe Christmas is in three days. I have my nice warm cup of hot water and lemon. I do have my ugly Christmas sweater on today. My boss wants us to wear our Christmas sweaters today for work. And we also have a meeting in a few minutes, so we get to see everybody's sweaters today. Finally on my lunch break, and I decided just to eat lunch instead of work out. I'll probably work out after work. And I'm having this Santa Fe style salad from Target. I haven't had this in such a long time. I'm so excited. And then I'm also going to have some leftover zucchini. So I just got done with my workout. I took a week off just because my body's been very tired, very drained. I wanted to give it a break. But yesterday was my first day back. I, I only did about 20 minutes. Today I went a lot harder. <laughs> I'm still out of breath, but I feel so much better. And I'm just gonna have half of this perfect protein bar and then some water. have to write them down so that I wouldn't forget so the first three goals kind of go together my first one is to get fit I'm very into working out. that's not an issue for me but I just want to be a little bit more consistent and try different workouts it's unfortunate that the gyms are closed I mean it's for a good reason but you know it's just always nice to have all the equipment and then we also have a gym here at the apartments but that's been closed for a while now and the second goal is to eat better. I don't eat terrible. I want to say when I first moved out on my own, since I wasn't cooking and I really didn't know how, I was eating out a lot, which is how I gained a lot of my weight. It could be the love pounds too. I'm not going to lie, that's a real thing. But I just want to eat better. I don't want to deprive myself, but I do want to have a balance, like a really good balance. My third goal is to limit my sugar intake. If you guys know me or if you guys have been watching my channel from the beginning, I love sweets and it's, you know, it's not really a sweet tooth. I have a sweet mouth. I always joke around about that just because, I don't know, it's pretty much out of control. But like I said, with goal number two, I don't want to deprive myself of anything. I want to have it at moderation. I don't want to just overdo it and eat it just because it's there. The next goal is to pay off my car. I still have about a year and a half, but my goal is to pay it off by next summer. So that is probably at the top of my list. I was fortunate enough in high school that my parents bought me my car, so I never really had a car payment until about a few years ago. So it would be nice to just pay it off completely. The next goal would be for Chase and I, and we would love to buy our own home. So that would be on top of my list, along with 
um, paying off my car just depending on how the market is how the rates are you know with everything going on with the virus everything's pretty much virtual and I don't want to do a virtual tour I want to like actually see the house so I mean it's just gonna depend on what it looks like next year my next goal would be to meditate more I've heard a lot of people say really good things about it I do get really bad anxiety sometimes so I feel like meditation would benefit me my next goal would be to shop less I've <laughs> always been a bit of a shopaholic my whole life as soon as I started working, making my own money, I was just buying everything that I wanted. And as soon as I moved down on my own, it kind of calmed down. I wasn't really buying as much as I used to just because I knew that I had bills. And I want to say 2019, I was really, really good at that. I did not buy anything unless it was like a birthday present or if it was a Christmas present. But 2020, I don't know if it's just because everybody was on lockdown and, you know, I did a lot of shopping. So 2021, I just want to buy things that I absolutely need, not that I want. There is a difference. So better work on that. <laughs> My next goal is to create new content for this channel. I love doing YouTube. It's so much fun for me. I do get a little bit of social anxiety now, so I feel like this has helped me kind of gain my confidence back. Like I've mentioned before, I've become a little bit more of an introvert, so it's just nice to kind of feel like myself again. My next goal would be to take care of my body, just stretch more. I just want to take care of my body because my body's taken care of me my whole life, so I just feel like I need to treat it better. And it's not just about eating healthier, it's just about taking care of myself. Whether it's getting acupuncture, or if it's getting massages once a month, taking ice baths, whatever I have to do to take care of my body, I feel like I just need to put a little bit more effort into it. So my last goal would be to read a new book every single month, or at least every other month. Books can get expensive, I do follow Allison Bickerstaff on YouTube and she rents books from the library. I think that's so smart because she's not spending money on books and you know she gets to check out a new book every time she's done with it. So I mean that's something I probably will consider um, but I don't know there's just something about going into a bookstore and buying a new book but we'll see. Maybe I'll buy some books and then maybe I'll just go to the library and check them out. So those are my goals for 2021. Like I said, this year went by so fast. I cannot believe the year is almost over. Christmas is in a few days. I'm just very appreciative of all my subscribers. Thank you guys so much for tuning in pretty much every day for Vlogmas, but also every week on my regular schedule. It really does mean a lot to me. I do put a lot into this channel. It's just, it's very fun for me. It's a very fun, creative outlet and I cannot wait to do more next year. So I have my Lakers championship shirt and I'm so excited the NBA season's back tonight. Lakers get their rings and I cannot wait. Well, I'm gonna close the video out here. I hope this inspired you guys with your 2021 goals. It's never too late to accomplish anything. If you guys have any goals, Leave them down in the comments below. I would love to read them. New year, new beginnings. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. And I will see you all tomorrow. Bye.